As an electrical engineer, I've seen my fair share of burnout motors, and in this video, we're going to take a deep dive into what causes electric motors to burn out and how you can prevent it from happening. Here's a list of the most common causes of electric motor burnout. Overheating, overloading, poor maintenance, electrical, mechanical issues, and environmental factors caused by contaminants. By addressing these common causes of motor burnout, you can help prevent your electric motor from failing prematurely and ensure a long and productive life for your equipment. Let's dive into some details. Overheating. One of the most common causes of electric motor burnout is overheating. This can be caused by a variety of factors, including high ambient temperatures, poor ventilation, or overloading the motor beyond its rated capacity. To prevent overheating, make sure your motor is properly sized for the load it's intended to carry. Additionally, ensure that it's properly ventilated and that there's adequate airflow around the motor. Overloading. Another common cause of electric motor burnout is overloading. This happens when you try to operate the motor beyond its rated capacity, which can cause it to overheat and eventually fail. To avoid overloading your motor, make sure you understand its rated capacity and don't exceed it. You can also consider using a soft starter or variable frequency drive to help regulate the motor's speed and prevent it from being overloaded. Poor maintenance. Neglecting regular maintenance is another common cause of electric motor burnout. Over time, dust, dirt, and other contaminants can build up inside the motor and cause damage to the bearings and other components. To prevent poor maintenance from causing burnout, make sure you follow the manufacturer's recommended maintenance schedule. This may include cleaning the motor, lubricating the bearings, and checking for signs of wear or damage. Electrical problems. Electrical problems can also contribute to electric motor burnout. These can include wiring issues, voltage fluctuations, or other electrical faults that cause the motor to operate outside its normal operating range. To prevent electrical problems from causing burnout, make sure your motor is properly wired and that the voltage is within the manufacturer's recommended range. You may also consider using surge protectors or other devices to protect the motor from power surges or other electrical issues. Mechanical issues. Finally, mechanical issues or design flaws can also cause electric motor burnout. These may include improper alignment, bearing failure, or other issues that cause excessive wear and tear on the motor's internal components. To prevent mechanical issues from causing burnout, make sure your motor is properly installed and that any alignment or bearing issues are addressed as soon as they're detected. Environmental factors. Environmental factors such as dirt, dust, and moisture can also contribute to electric motor burnout. These contaminants can get inside the motor and cause damage to the bearings and other internal components. Moisture can also cause rust and corrosion, which can lead to motor failure. To prevent environmental factors from causing burnout, make sure your motor is properly protected from the elements. Use covers or enclosures to keep dirt and dust out, and avoid exposing the motor to moisture. How to prevent burnout Now that we've talked about the most common causes of electric motor burnout, let's look at some tips for preventing it from happening to you. Follow the manufacturer's recommended maintenance schedule. Keep the motor clean and free of debris. Lubricate the bearings. Ensure proper ventilation and airflow around the motor. Use the motor within its rated capacity and avoid overloading it. Check for signs of wear or damage regularly. Address any mechanical issues or design flaws promptly. Protect the motor from environmental factors such as dirt, dust, and moisture. Use surge protectors or other devices to protect the motor from electrical issues. Thanks for tuning in to Electricity Frenzy, and be sure to subscribe for more electrical tips and tricks.